The world's out of balance. The COVID-19 has sped up this out of balance. We have left and right going further and further apart. We have the haves and have nots getting more and more apart. And this on top of the ongoing wars and catastrophes and suffering and murder, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Surely we can do better than this. Surely this is not the way it's supposed to be on earth. It calls to the question, why are we here? Is this the best that we can do on earth? Is there a purpose to life on earth? And more importantly, perhaps most importantly, are we alone in the universe? So many people around the world are really wondering and seeing evidence of UFOs. The Pentagon has formed a task force to look into UFOs. But what if I told you that I know someone who has communicated with extraterrestrials since 1954. Would you believe me? But he's received over 600 highly important and spiritual Mr. messages. He had to go into an advanced yogic somatic trance state to receive the most important of these messages. I am Neon is what if I told you that within these transmissions, the answers to those most important questions on Earth could be found? Would you believe me? What if I told you that the reason why we are not being contacted openly by space intelligences is that they are waiting for a sign from us that we are ready to change our world in a positive way? What if I told you the purpose to life is to move from selfishness to selflessness, which really is the basis of all the great spiritual traditions on earth today. What if I told you that our most advanced spiritual masters on earth, such as the Lord Buddha, Sri Krishna, the Master Jesus, were all beings from other worlds? Would you still believe? What if I told you that the earth we live on is not just an inanimate space rock, but a very evolved, intelligent being. What if I told you that you could make a difference and improve the situation we have upon our earth? Everyone deserves to know the truth. The truth in this case is absolutely stranger than fiction. Now this is a metaphysical breakthrough. Uh, for the first time on the physical levels of Earth, we can actually store prayer power. The Ethereum Society in Los Angeles was a combination of a mystery school and a commando base. You're learning advanced mantras, advanced prayer techniques. Um, you're learning to build radiotic machines, to use these machines to transmit spiritual energy to places in need like after earthquakes and hurricane hit. It was an intense, amazing time to be with Dr. King. Are you curious yet? If so, I invite you to dive into the rabbit hole and listen for yourself some of these amazing transmissions received by Dr. King, which will completely open your eyes to what's happening on and beyond our world.